Well, I listened to this tape, I couldn't believe it. And every time I listen to it, I still can't believe it. But I go entirely by the integrity of this good friend of mine who knows the people that recorded this. And if it wasn't for him and his reputation, I would say something is really weird about this tape. What happened was, and uh, as related to me by Dr. Schneider from Kansas City, a group of seven people in Kansas City got together for choir practice. Have you heard this? Anybody heard this? Okay, a few people have. I, I, everywhere I go around the country, one or two people have heard of it, or have heard about it. But this is the tape of it. Uh, seven people got together for choir practice in a church in Kansas City, and they were checking the sound equipment and their harmony. And they sang the chorus, Hallelujah, through. They paused, and then they sang it through again. That was the a cappella, no instruments. And when they started playing it back, they thought something went wrong with the system until they realized that there were thousands of voices singing with them. There was a harp, bass guitar, trumpet, all sorts of things in there. And then during the time that they had paused, there's a solo, which none of them sang. To complicate matters, one of the men that was singing with them a few months later went down to Haiti on a mission trip, and when he was down there, the group, uh, the, the, the church they were ministering at, the song leader was leading them in the, the Hallelujah Chorus, and during the middle of it, he started singing this chorus, or the, the verse that's found on this tape. And he went up to the song director afterwards, who didn't speak any English, and asked him where he got the words to that verse that he sang. And he said, I didn't sing a verse. How can you explain it? You can't. Uh, but I, I have a friend in Lubbock, Texas. I'll be with him next week, and he's a uh, music professor. And he listened to this tape, and he said, Claude, there are voices on there that are higher than the human vocal range can go, and they are sustained for a longer time than what the human voice can sustain one note with that much clarity. And so there's no other explanation for it except supernatural.